Alrighty, SMPK. So what have we played in this one? I've been playing a lot of the um, plus ships. NGA, Mantis A, NGB, Kestrel A I've played so far. I think we unlocked one or two more the other day. So that was the second page here. We unlocked the Kestrel B. The NGC. How do I unlock some of these other ones? Are they, um... Do they take those keys we gotta get to? What's his face? That we got one messed up some somehow last time, I think. Let's look at the Kestrel B type. I think this is the one that uh, Slow Rider said you liked because it's got. It's basically a rebel ship. Yeah, we basically fly as the rebels on this one. The Turncoat. I really like this uh, ship color, it looks really nice. The Turncoat. This Kestrel cruiser is crewed by a group of rebel defectors, equipped to be effective with the strategies that you are that they are familiar with. Okay. So four rebel crew, a laser blaster, which is uh, two power, two shots, eight second charge time. A Lido, one power, one shot. Ability enhancer, multi-purpose augment, a special enhancement. For crew members, that grants improvements to their active abilities, making them more effective and flexible. The changes vary depending on crew type and can be viewed by mousing over the ability button. So human ability is... All stats are increased for 12 seconds. Oh, this is a boarding ship. Oh, interesting. So if I mouse over their ability... Okay, it needs to be charged before I'll be able to see what... Buffs, I guess, I guess. Honestly, Lido with Teleporter is pretty decent uh, combo. I will say 2% Teleporter, not great, but... This, this is like boarding with Marines in uh, StarCraft. You're, you, you board and you stim. <laughs> Pull out your machine gun. It's literally a rebel ship, hybrid gunship boarding. Yeah. This will be an interesting one. Let me uh, let me wait till they their ability charge up because I want to mouse over it to see what it does. Do, 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 do. And I think it's gonna just give them all stats up, but I wonder if it'll tell me how much. There we go. Let's see. Increase movement, sabotage, repair speed by 60%, melee damage by 30%. So that means they'll have, what, 1.3 times melee damage for 12 seconds, which is... almost as much as a Mantis. And their sabotage speed is really fast. Okay. All right, this looks like this could be a pretty darn good boarding ship. Let's check it out, man. What a twist! <laughs> Free hacking on my engines. Let's go here. Oh, they boarded me though. Don't board me. All right. Use our use our stim. I hope he doesn't use his stim. Oh, he's got a mantis though. Oh god, I don't even know if I win this. If I pull one of them, no. I still won't leave. Ah. Okay. You should you should like fix your shields and stuff so that you know you don't die and stuff. Okay, good. We're all going back to heal. Thankfully you can't actually heal them. Do 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 Cross boarding, that's kinky. Okay. Uh, A, B, E, N basically doubles the strength of the effect for a human rebel crew. You don't think I used the ability on the two? Oh, I thought I did. Whoops, that's my bad. I meant to. I thought I hit P, but apparently I did not hit P. That's still the button for it, right? Yeah, okay. There it is. My bad. Should have done that before. Would have been an easier fight. Probably would have won. Oh, well, we didn't take any damage, so we're good. 
I thought I peed, but I didn't. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> it's better than, you know, the other. Uh, you don't know if Mantis have normal 1.5 damage for this mod. Oh yeah, it's, I can't, that's true. I don't remember if SMPK has 1.5 damage on Mantis or not. Do -do 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 -do. Ignore that. Okay, you have a flak and a heal day. That is not fun. There, did it that time. I'm gonna hit the heal day. Even though I need to get his black offline. Oh, that's a fire. Hey, good Dumble Doge, man. Okay. Damn, he's got one more crew. Okay, good Dumble Doges, though. Okay. Uh. Okay, his flak is offline. That's good. I'm not sure if I win this, so I need. I'm gonna spend one other crew to make sure we do win this. If I do this, that will pull him into the shield. Perfect. There it is. Get blasted. Nice double reward. I'll take it. It took you a while to figure out that current hypercode actually allows for actives to be completely changed when holding certain augments. Cool. Well, that is pretty cool that the, uh, there's a ship based around increasing their special abilities. If this was a four-person teleporter, four-person teleporter, three rebels with crystal would make for perfect system demolish troops. It would be pretty darn strong at that, that's for sure. Let's go shield value. Get power next, and then we'll get try to get our level two shields up. All right. Um. Thank you, Captain. Okay, it's nothing. Cool. Great. Well, you gave me your gratitude, which sadly doesn't do anything, but you're welcome. Two basic lasers, eh? He's got boarding too. Can I board in shields and him not board me? At least didn't hit my shields. He is gonna go in here though, to heal. Let's do that. How much? Okay, you're gonna win that. I think. Okay, okay. No, oh, that's not what I meant to do. Don't die. Okay, I gotta finish him. Oh boy. Power generator is nice. Whew, I feel like this ship needs one extra power to start, honestly. Not quite sure. Most vanilla ships have enough that you can power your engines, your shields, and your starting weapons. This one, maybe because you give it one extra weapon power, decided not to give it enough for its engines, but. I feel like this ship needs one extra power to start. So we're gonna have at least this online. But we'll get our shield up next, I guess. Okay, attack. What are we gonna attack? It's peaceful. Wait, it's not peaceful. Ah, cloaking sector one. That's random. Beedy bum. No, oh, it's a it's a mantis. Let's see if we can get the. Uh... Okay, I think I think we win this. If I swap them in the middle here. This is really close. I'm not gonna chance it. 
Oh, we cloaked on me, bro. Oh, that's that's not cool. Oh, that's not cool. This is why you don't get fucking cloaking to Sector 1 ships, man. Uh, I think I might need to restart this run now. This is, uh, this is a boarding ship that just lost boarding. God damn it, man. God, that pisses me the hell off. Why does everybody who mod FTL give every ship goddamn cloaking, hacking, mind control bullshit, man? God damn it. Ugh. I don't know if there's a way I could have kept him alive there with fucking cloaking over here. God damn it, man, that's so frustrating. Losing crew on a boarding ship is crippling. I don't know, maybe I could have stayed in there and won the fight, but there was still one crew left, so I don't I don't even know that that would have saved me. I needed apparently to shoot cloaking first, I don't know. God damn it, man. Yeah, cloaking sector one is ridiculous. Even vanilla doesn't do that to you. It'll give Zoltan shield, which is probably worse, but... God, see, I went from a ship with cloaking to a ship with fucking hacking, man. Don't hit my weapons. I swear modders love to just give extra systems to enemies, and I don't understand it. When do cloaking ships come into play in Manila? Oh, I don't know, three maybe? I don't I don't have it memorized. I don't I don't remember exactly. Uh, the ship does not start with many missiles either. Doesn't matter what I aim at, apparently. Level 2 hacking, Sector 1. Well, Rebel Auto hackers are in vanilla. Okay, I'll get that offline at least. Only auto scouts, although sometimes they can even go up to level two cloak as early as sector one. So auto scouts can have cloaking in vanilla in sector one. I don't think any non-scout ships can have cloaking before sector two or three, I think. Oh my god. That is frustrating. To lose one of my boarding crew because of frickin' cloaking bullshit. With pause, I really shouldn't have failed that. I don't I don't know how. Well, I do know how, because they have they had a goddamn mantis and two other crew. Just extra crew more than they should have normally. Okay, we'll get that bomb offline. That means there's a fire in there. Yeah. Oh, I don't think I win this fight. Um, no. Don't actually kill O2 though. Okay. Oh man. I always have such a fun time with RBG Nerdo ships, and then I swap to SMPK or Multiverse, and I'm like, oh, this is so much more stressful. Which I guess means they got the balance right the balance of FTL being stronger than you all the time and everything being a pain in the ass to try to not die. Oh, God damn it. Yeah, I don't have enough for that. All right, you 
got a missile. But he's not another Mantis, although he's got a lot of crew. Man, a rock, dude. Okay. Okay, good dodge. Good dodge. That is a Zoltan. Well, I wasn't expecting the missile to come back online. F your missiles. F them. Do, 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 do. Repair that missile. I think that might be a two power missile, maybe? Or two damage missile if it's taking so long to repair. Mm. Yeah. Nope. You gotta offer me a free flak, dude. Uh, yeah, their power hadn't actually recharged yet. Oh, man. Even with special powers, I feel like the humans are worse borders than just having a rock and a mantis. Just think if we had the mantis with his special, uh, special ability boosted, this would be really strong for boarding. Speaking of mantis... Uh, he's got more crew, damn it. Okay, he wins that fight. Don't die, please. Seriously, burn down. The fire went out. F you, FTL. Give me a break. Come on, no weapons for you. Stop having weapons. Ninja repairing. Just a human. Okay. Double human boarding. Ugh. 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 Can I have a free crew on this boarding ship, please? May I please, for the love of God, have a free crew to make up for the. BS crew I lost, man. No free crew sector one on a boarding ship. All useless humans. True. You want to be the most useless of all? The pilot? Let's go to clone bay and four shots. End of sector one, four shots. Okay. Indeed. You are the most useless of all humans. Congratulations. Get Clone Bay offline. Okay. Prepare this. Boom, 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 boom. Do, 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 Finish him. Is that GG? Okay. Hey, we got a weapon at least for our troubles. Okay. Freya. That almost sounds like a Hungarian name. Almost. Let's make one that's really, really Hungarian. The most Hungarian of all. Attila. Let's go. Oh, we got organ music going on here. What the hell is this? 
What is this weapon? Use a missile that doesn't bypass shields, right? It does three damage, though. Okay. We got power trader, power generators. Must have gotten that from a random extra reward. Oh god, do I go to Mantis when I'm like already having a hard time boarding? I feel like Nebula, Nebula's even scarier. Also correct the the uh, Hungarian name thing. <laughs> And it's probably like all the uh, people in the Islamic nations naming so many people Muhammad, right? Oh my god. Okay. Do this and this. Okay. Jesus. Although probably not quite the same as that. Let me close this door, please. Love of God, let me close this door. Wait, where are you even going? Okay. Damn it. Go into shields? Okay. Oh my God. I should have used her special ability. There we go. What's the famous name or the most basic name in the US? Probably John or something. Named after, I don't know, John Adams or something. Yeah, four free mantis. Get dealt with though. Alright, uh, do I even want distress beacon? I have like no blue options for distress beacons with this ship. Asteroid helped us out though. Okay, that's great. Well, we got a breach in weapons. That's I think that was in weapons. I'm pretty sure. I feel like there's a lot more asteroids in this field than normal. Yep. Buy one asteroid, get the second one off. What, for just one penny. I might buy a Mantis crew right now. This crew is really... Although, there's mind control, I'm not with that. It's dead. Oh, man. The boss fight in this mod, I still don't have memorized, so I don't know what systems are best. If I just want hack and cloaking, or if I need to go for mind control. I don't have the boss fight memorized, I just... What I have memorized is that it's ridiculous, and insane, and scary as hell. Okay, let's go fight in there so they can't repair it. If I do this, we win the fight and the other guy will be repairing shields over this. It can't do damage to us, so let's just do it this way. No dodge training, but we can do that. There we go. Nice. Nice little dolphin flip. Use pause, though. Sometimes try to figure out the way asteroid fields attack the ship. Sometimes it feels as if they had volleys where they are firing an asteroid every two, three seconds, and they stop for a slightly longer amount of time. Yeah, I, I, I assume it's some sort of randomness, but I don't, I don't, I've never learned the timing on asteroids. To me, it always feels like it's faster at the beginning and then it slows down, but I don't know if that's just how it feels or if there is some actual programming behind that. Oh, it's a double store. Okay. Okay. Uh, skirt the perimeter. Okay, free stuff is free stuff. Probably sell this Atlantis thing. 
Oh, I have some trade goods. Yes, power generators. Nice. It's hacking. There's mind control. There's drone control. There's... Wow. Okay. Weapon tool kit. Emergency power. There's a lot of stuff here. There's a mantis. What's your special ability? Uh, increase melee damage by 25%. That would be really good. All right, we're going to do that. Keep the... Um, who's the guy with the best dodge? This guy. Keep the ability enhancers. But then we got to do something else here. Um, no way we're going to have enough missiles to use that. First laser three. I could wait and see what's at the next store. I think I do want to do that. That's his just base stats. Are you talking about his 25%? Yeah, so it's going to be even more once we uh, buff it. Let's see if it says 50% here. Melee damage by 50%. That's going to be really freaking strong. There's a burst laser too. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Could just get another Mantis, but uh, you know what? See burst laser by burst laser. I will need... I can get that other guy online, actually. Let's do that. Let's sell the Lido. As much as I said, that's pretty useful for uh, really boarding. That's just five shots for four power, which is much better. Okay, we didn't get any systems, but the one crew should, should make the aborting much better. And that burst laser 2 is going to help a lot. That will be 2.6 times damage on the Mantis when he's using his ability. That's crazy. Oh, man, there's a chance at a free Mantis. It's also a chance to lose crew, which is way, way, way too big of a risk on a boarding ship that we just spent scrapped by crew on. Arms dealer. Okay. Two point six times damage. That doesn't seem nearly like that much. <laughs> Cat's fire. I did not seem that crazy fast at all, honestly. Am I crazy, or did that just kind of seem normal-ish? I don't even know if the stim has been working that well. Because the humans are beating other humans, but the other humans are not using their stim ability. So I honestly don't know if this, this augment is working. Feels a bit like it's not, actually. Still, we went against humans, and we probably even went against human and mantis if we turn our ability on. Okay, they're gonna board us. Okay. By the way, that was a free heavy laser, which is pretty awesome. Okay, let's heal before we go back over there. Uh, let's check the sensors while he's healing. How many crew do you got? Command send an NG. All right, we should win this fight. So if we go one, two, three, one, two, go. Is there a fire? There's a fire in the weapons room. So we board in the heal bay and GG. They should pull at least one of them, I think. Really? No? You're just gonna let us take out your ship? Okay. Alright, I'll take some fighting training, I guess. I think we get fighting training for damaging stuff. Yeah. Now well, you're repairing, so let's stop that now. Stop it.
It does look like enemies don't use their crew special ability in SMPK. Is that purposeful? You feel like it's getting 1.2 damage increased to 1.8 damage. Okay. Hey, I can't use that actives. That's deliberate. Okay, cool. Oh, this... I want to go 1-2, but... I don't want to risk a dive. I think this might not be a dive, but I don't want to chance it. Okay, this is a uh, heavy drone. Thank God he didn't hack my shields. Okay. Three Mantis crew. Well, that's scary. Um... Wow. Um... Can my human survive this? I'm gonna shoot... I'm gonna shoot them once or twice. I'm gonna, I need to soften up the guy. Okay. Those guys are both softened up a bit. That, that'll help us win this fight, I think. I'll still have to run away to heal, most likely, but... Their abilities on, hopefully we can win this. Honestly, a uh, human, even with his ability... Okay, he is beating a mantis. Okay, that's good. Actually, we look, look like we might be just good here. But let's not chance it. Hey, pharmaceuticals. Okay, that's a uh, free stuff to shell, I think. I think that's a trade good. I wonder what sector pharmaceuticals sell better in. Large populations in heavily industrial areas. Is that NG? Is NG heavy industrial? I don't know what heavy industrial means. Oh, it's all the whole worlds. Oh, it's all the whole worlds. Let's go. Gosh, I should go NG. I'm, I'm too afraid of all the home worlds. You think industrial means rebel? Okay. Store it for 15. Eh. So it's longer charge time and lower fire and breach chance. I might want to actually restore that. But I don't want to spend the scrap on it yet. I can get some doges up. I feel like we're pretty far behind, honestly. Oh, that's a level two heal day. Whoops. Oh god, don't take damage from me. You f single fire double fucking single laser double fucking fire man oh my god this is this is really bad okay his ions online that's good it's actually really good for us okay no more heal bay we win this Man, we are not getting free crew on this boarding ship, man. The only crew I've gotten, I paid for. Not a, not a huge fan of that. We need some free crew game. We've been boarded. Okay. Alright. 
everybody use their special ability and kill these freaking humans coming on my ship. Well, one's a hologram, one's an NG, but still, kill them. We don't take kindly your, take kindly your kind around here kindly. Would you kindly vent yourself? Okay. Storage key Epsilon. Okay. So we need to keep this for the entire run. Oh, God. He's got cloaking, a missile, and running away. Hey, FTL, you know what you can do? Don't be a little nicer to me. How about that? Because this is bullshit. This is a bullshit roll. I don't know which keys I've done. I, 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 I don't know. What do you know? His first missile hit my goddamn weapons. I'm so surprised by this. Goddamn this game, man, I swear. Hey, what do you know? Zero dodges for me. Okay, somehow that weapon out went offline. And F this game. Uh, sell this. God, it's so frustrating. Stupid BS like that. Running away, cloaking, and a missile. Hey, let's have all of the upside, none of the downside. Sounds like a balanced way to make a game. Sounds great. Sounds great. It's almost like I've never played FTL with how frustrated I get with the same mechanics every time. Air systems. Bombay Mercy Power. When I sell this, get the heavy laser online, then we'll try to get it upgraded, maybe. Or do I want to get, like, clone bay? Maybe I get clone bay for boarding. Let's do that. Sixteen scrap left. Sell that and get power. That sells for 30? Wow. We'll want to spend the 15 scrap to make this thing not the crappier version of itself. Teleporter disruptor. Holy crap, we just got a whole laser like three for free. Uh, is that better? Better at not killing the ship if we hit system rooms. Same charge time. Wow, that's a really nice pickup. Uh, let me go ahead and do that. I do want one more engine power. Although, this is an empty jump. I think now we'll be able to upgrade that. You bet Teleport Disruptor still doesn't beat Zoltan Shield Bypass or Free Borders. Probably not. Wow, level 3 doors. Okay. Check we started a fire in anywhere. We did not. Okay, board in the teleporter, and that should be GG. I mean, the board in the heal bay. Very nice. Uh, we need this to be Mantis fighting Mantis. There we go. Uh, this is exactly what it says on the tin. Knocks out enemy teleporters, but doesn't prevent auto boarding, just like Zoltan shields. It's really fun to use against phase three and turn it into a clown car. Okay.
Yeah, I don't heal anymore. I gotta do this. I just made this run take a lot longer to, by getting Clone Bay, but it is better to do this, so. I make a mod for random vanilla that makes Zoltan Shield a blue option against free borders. <laughs> That'd be funny. What's up, Vega? Okay. So I have a choice of whether I want to go to this store or not, so I'll have to decide about that. Double heavy laser and beam drone, so he can do damage to us. Let's see if he's got an anti-drone drone, or anti-personnel. Okay, it's a repair drone, alright. Keep trying to hit B for backup battery, which I do not have. Clone Bay for you. Oh crap, does he have another crew member? You have somebody repairing this? No, okay, alright. Actually, was there a repair drone in there? There was. Ooh, he almost, I think, did. He almost did get repaired there. Ponder, do rebels have different abilities from humans? Um, I feel like humans, no, other humans have stim as well, so I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it's the same ability. Yeah, the visual visuals on the ship are really cool. I do, I agree with that. Rebel elites have different abilities. Okay, rebel elites. Sounds scary. 53 scrap. I could get long range scanners, I guess. Give me my last augment slot. Uh, so I got this from the NG Homeworlds. I wonder if that means it unlocks the NG ship, because I've already done that. Almost wonder if I don't even need this for an unlock, but I feel like I have I'm kind of forced to keep it. I really want some more dodge. Nope. Power first. Uh, I already unlocked NGR, so it's up to you. Or NG. Um, well, do you is are you are you verifying to me that Epsilon, because it says that I got it from NG Homeworlds, means that that is an NG, the NG unlock. Because I'm going to sell it if I don't need it. Nice, free stuff. Alright, we... I don't think we have any blue options for this. So of course we, get, we lose the 50-50, what a big surprise. You rebel scum. Okay, so I'll sell this at the next store. This uh, Epsilon key. Hopefully it sells for more than zero. <laughs> so we've gotten... Oh crap, I just missed out on a jump. Damn it. I feel... Okay, I can do my... I can at least do this. So let's do that. Now this fires faster? Yeah, and has a higher fire and reach chance, okay. I missed I missed out on a jump. I just completely picked too quickly there. Oh my god, a rebel dropship, okay. With four boarding. left. Still has four. Okay. 
probably not gonna board this guy. Yep, we're gonna kill this guy. Get blasted. Okay, I guess there's a couple jumps to heal up here, so I'm not gonna use my, uh... Uh, not gonna refresh them yet. So I do have this to sell. You don't think you've seen dropships board with four people only as high as three? Yeah, they probably need to have more crew on the ship so that all their systems stay, stay manned or whatever. Probably I'm going to keep that. What do I need right now? I feel like I need some sort of defensive system to deal with missiles. So it's either cloaking hacking or drone control, but they're all super duper ridiculously expensive. Hacking even more than normal because of changes to that. Uh, piercing halberd beam. No thanks. There's long range scanners. I do want that. Okay, that does sell for 20. I'll decide if I want to keep this. Security override. Weakens enemy ship security. Walk past sealed doors. Okay, that's pretty interesting. Get the backup battery. Honestly, I'm feeling pretty darn behind right now. What do we got? Three nebula jumps over here, so... Two gets us ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Does it make my crew phasing, or does it just limit their doors to level 1 or level 0? I don't know. Seems like it, the way it described it makes it sound like they become phasing, but I don't know. It grants them phase walk, okay. Okay. That is a lot of ions and burst lasers. Probably NG Medbot dispersal on this ship. Ugh. Uh, okay. Three shields and this much weapon power. I don't even know what to shoot right now. I think I need to go for weapons. Hey, when you know I got no dodges and he got enough for me to only do one damage, or two damage. I guess we at least got the first laser offline. I guess this is good, I guess. Again, just enough dodges. Come on, game. Give me a break here. I mean, I don't think I can board this. This guy's got too many NGs in the heal bay. Jesus Christ, man, seriously. This guy has backup battery of his own. Triple fucking hit, man. And now I can't even run. I hate this game. I really friggin' hate this game. Finally hit all my shots. What happens? The fucking drone drops my jo blocks my second heavy laser. F you, FTL. Like seriously, F you. You're a piece of F. F respects for my ship dying. Honestly. Finally, we dodge a goddamn bullet. Die, you piece of shit. In it. I had goddamn half the dodges of my enemies, I swear. Do I like this game? I hate it. I hate this game. That's why I play it three times a week. To get all my hate and rage out. Did I do any progress yesterday? How about Crazy Adventures? You fell a point at some you fell asleep at some point. Uh yeah. We had a lot of fun. It was um Me and Shogi both died at least once on the uh 
whatever it's called, Blood Moon. It was fun. Alright, I don't know what this ion does, but I'm a little afraid. Looks like some sort of upgraded ion stunner. Okay, at least it doesn't do double ion damage per shot or anything like that. Oh my god, I think he's just gonna be stunned forever. Okay, he got out. That self, uh, whatever is it? Self stacks, okay. Thank god for dodges there. I didn't meet for his dodges though. Anti personnel and four crew. Yeah, our boarding ship is worthless. We just, we can't even board. Two-person boarding is just not good enough. Well, we'll double fire, maybe. And with Clone Bay, maybe. What about this? If I get that offline. Okay, well we killed all but one. I hope his ship doesn't burn down in the meantime. Let's go finish him off with this guy. Alright, the only reason we let we get crew kills there was because we had triple double fires or something like that. What are special abilities? Uh humans have a stim which Upgrade all their abilities by a little bit. Ah, right, here, I'll just show you. Stim shot. Increase all stats for 12 seconds. Mantis. Increase movement speed and melee damage for 8 seconds. And we have an augment that the ship starts with that doubles... Supposedly doubles the stat changes. I'm not 100% sure it's doing the doubling, but... Supposedly that's what it's doing. 1, 2, 3... Four, five, six. I should be able to get seven. I want the ship fights or do I want another store? 52 scrap. We have compressed oxygen to sell. So I'd probably take a store right now to sell that. If I could choose between life of a survivor and a zombie, which one would it be? Okay. Uh, why would anybody choose the life of a zombie? Uh, I'll go with survivor. I'll go with Survivor. And that's 7 power. Yeah, I'm gonna need more power for this. I mean, do you mean the unlife? Zombies are dead or undead, right? Um. This looks different FTL, it is. It's called SMPK Insurrection that we're playing. Alright, do I board? I feel like I don't have enough power to run my stuff. So if I do a little more damage to these systems, then I'll board. I need him to not have weapons online. There it is. Let's do it. Okay, let's double fire, go in here. Uh, of course it's an anti-personnel drone. Why wouldn't it be? Well, at least we're kicking his ass, actually. Oh, he's got a rock, dude. Okay, what's uh 4v3, I guess, here? I don't even think we win 4v3, huh. <laughs> but we'll try. Turn on your guys' abilities. Oh, it's... Still has his drone, of course he does. You know what? Kill everybody. 
kill kill everybody. I have clone babe. F you. Get blasted. Get everybody in a room and kill them all. Eat it. Need to respawn them anyway. Might as well kill the ship at the same time. <laughs> Fed up with your anti-personnel drones on every ship. Kill you all. I will destroy your mother and your father and your dog and your house plant. Use my most final desperation attack. That's right. If I could be any of the FTL Space Explorer racers, which one would you mostly feel attracted to? <coughs> attracted to? Probably other humans, as I am a human. Uh... No, none of the other races do I look at and go, hubba hubba. I think for the proliferation of my species, I would probably choose other humans. Not even Mantis? <laughs> yes, I'd love to go to bed with somebody who's got swords for arms. They have a nightmare, go like this, and all of a sudden my head is cut off. Don't think I'd uh, be up for that. I like, I like keeping my head where it is, on the top of my body. Uh, you'd pick to be Crystal or Zoltan. You're attracted to the peeps of the race you pick. Okay. Which one, Laura and otherwise, would I want to join and fight for? Lore? Uh... I'm a loner, so I'll pick Crystal. Be off in my own galaxy where... I don't have humans coming and bugging me all the time. My best, that's my best answer. I have, I have two system slots here. I feel if I don't get cloaking and hacking the boss fight, it's gonna be really hard, but I'm gonna get mind control. I'm just gonna do that. There's Zoltan Shield Bypass, actually. Interesting. 52 scrap. So I could sell this whole laser and this ability enhancer and get Zoltan Shield Bypass. Do I want that? Just get a clone bay? I have a clone bay. Do I want to get Zoltan Shield Bypass? With only two borders, probably not. God, I don't want to sell this, but it's going to take me forever to actually be able to use this thing. But I'm gonna need these shots if I'm not getting cloaking on the, for the boss fight, or for, if I'm not getting hacking. And I'm only gonna be able to get hacking or cloaking. I'm not gonna be able to get both. God, I need so much... Ah, scrap right now. That ability enhancer at the boarding is going to be even worse. You might be right. Flayed of this black. Okay, good. It's offline. Problem now is he can heal, and I only have two crew versus his eight or five or whatever he's got on this ship. It's so hard to get any kind of crew kills right now, honestly. Actually, there's a fire in here that will just benefit the rock dudes. They're going to shields. Will that pull anybody? Okay, that's that's broken. So let's do this. couple dudes. Uh, actually, yeah, I have to mind control to not just lose this fight, I think. Mm 
Oh, I just might lose this fight even with mind control. Cool. Great. Clombe and teleporter. I need so much stuff right now. We are so freaking far behind right now. Okay, nobody's repairing that. Got this. Kind of have my ability back up yet. Pretty long cooldown on the abilities, I guess. If I plan to go full gunship, might as well sell that. Uh, well, I feel like I'm going to board when I can, so... I don't really want to sell the ability enhancer yet. But the, the problem is if I sell it, I don't really get anything that good for it right now. So the fact that I'm just so far behind is making this really rough. It's a cool sounding track right here. Oh God. Well, mind control doesn't help us in this situation at all. Okay, that's great. Can I dodge this missile? Nope, I can get my weapons one shot by a three fucking damage missile. Because that's balanced. I'm gonna guess that's a three damage missile for two powers, my guess. Because it's one of those overclocked things. Maybe it's a three power for three shots, I don't know. Or a three power for three damage. Uh, the skill does increase repair speed. Oh, I need to be doing that. Okay, my bad. I didn't know it did that. I Or I forgot. It does for humans, not for Mantis, I think. I should be using the human ability for repair speed. My bad. Good reminder. I'm gonna do this because if I lose Krugo, this run is over. Nice. Free stuff. Always love free stuff. This will be an empty jump. Oh! You change it so that uh, Nebula exit beacons are not empty. Nice. This should get me crew, right? Nice. Nice. Alright. Um, oh, what is his ability to do? Stuns nearby enemies for five seconds. Cannot repair or attack crew systems. That seems kind of bad. I guess it allows your other one other crew in the room to attack for free. So I guess that's not terrible. It's probably better than having a human. Is it better than having a human? I don't know that's any better. Yeah, the slug only doesn't attack during the stun, I, th I think. Then he starts attacking after that, if I'm not mistaken. I'm going for Kazak here. Immediate store, huh? I don't really have anything to sell. Mastery field. I probably need to go here to repair to get fuel, though. Cyplos enables fighting, but with a damage penalty. Oh, really? Okay. Well, let's check that out. Unusable. No enemies nearby. Okay. Well, I can't look at it then. Unless there's enemies there. I mean, I'd love to get systems, but Jesus Christ. It's so expensive. Because systems need to be nerfed in FTL. Right. Right, guys. Right. They need to be nerfed. Okay, now can I look at what it does? Four seconds, reduce melee damage. Okay, he does do melee damage, good. And stun. 
Once it's done, ends. I'm gonna move in here and mind control a okay. guy. Fire everything at weapons. Okay, that is that bombed. Okay. Good frickin' dodges. Ooh, this looks like we just win this fight now. Okay, that's size stun plus mind control. It's pretty darn good. Okay. Nice. Okay, that was surprisingly effective. Using my increased repair speed now here. Artillery for the ship. Flowrider says it's portable phase three. Not quite sure what portable means though. Uh, hey, great mate. Thanks for 21 months. Dumbledoge for to wins, my friend. Good to see you. Thing to note is high impact rounds affects that ability, so when you start stacking with other slugs, very silly things can potentially be done. High impact rounds is the thing that makes stuns last longer? Is that right? Pretty interesting sounding combo. Is there a ship that starts with slug borders and high impact rounds? That would be pretty cool to test. Man, level three doors, you don't say. Heal bay. Oh my gosh, how would I, how do I go about this fight? I guess it's this. Stun when they get in here again. Then mind control. Fire weapons first, because that flak just needs to get offline. Flak needs to go. Nice. Now we can deal with these guys. Okay. Well, that deleted that guy. Cool. My guys are gonna die slowly, but these guys can finish him off. Okay. Uh, there's one ship that starts with high impact rounds and slugs, but it's not a boarding ship. Okay. Oh my god, we find. Is that our. That's only our second free crew, right? The slug, I think, was our first free crew. Oh, that is such. Such a relief to finally get a free crew, man. Well, well, to finally get another free crew. I finally feel like we're making a little bit of headway here. Um, okay, if we're going to want to kill Kazak, oh, what do I want to do? Do I want to get one more dodge or do I want to get third shield? What is my final system going to be? Is it going to be cloaking or is it going to be hacking? With as many shots as I have, I think I want to go cloaking. Which means i got to save up scrap for that. But let's get... One more dodge, we can back up battery that, and then we're gonna work towards third shield next, I think. All right, there's Kazak. Holy, he's got four shields. Six crew, four shields. What the hell? Oh man, you made Kazak way more overpowered. Jesus Christ. Uh, why didn't you fight him fucking here, shit game? I don't know if I'm gonna get crew killed. I don't I don't know if I can even do damage to this guy. Oh my god, this is so ridiculous. Okay, honestly pretty good dodges. Can't get through four shields, man. Can I? Oh, I can't have. I can't have O2 because you freaking destroyed my O2. This is so insane. He 
I'm surprised he actually rolled medical with that much in other systems. God damn it. How much how much freaking okay, I'm gonna use your repair plus thing here. There. Go there. Use your ability. Okay. Let me fire one more shot, then I'm boarding. I cannot believe this guy has this much shit. This is honestly insane. Okay, and that's really good. Mind control you. Board in... What do I even board in? Board in shields? I don't have my special ability right now. I don't even think we win this fight. However, if I kill my own dudes here... This is a chain, not a charge. So this uh, this isn't a pierce, so... Okay. Just hoping I've one-shot one of their guys, but I need to get some shields offline to even get through these shields consistently. The only good thing is, he's. I'm actually glad he has extra health. Oh, man. Because it means we can actually get the crew kill without killing a ship, most likely. He's got so much system power. There we go. Okay. I control this. I need to stop him from healing, so I need to now go into here. Okay, I think I think we might have this. Damn it, if this thing ever hits us, we're screwed. Uh... There we go. Holy hell, what a damn fight that was. Jesus Christ, how much weapon power was that? Is this only a three power weapon? I don't know. That's two, I think. That's... think two. So I think this was something like a five or six weapon power thing. Oh wow, you gave Slug Crew a blue option for this. Quickly, teleport additional crew. Check for survivors. Quickly, confirm the clone to save him. Your haste has paid off. Holy crap, that was... Man, you made me earn freaking Kazak there, that's for sure. Oh, he's got a special ability too, okay. He's wearing vanilla, because uh, that's usually low rolls. Yeah, I'd agree with that. But what I will also say is that Manta ships in general are a lot weaker in vanilla. Does hazmat suits make it harder to get uh, vented? <laughs> yeah. Okay. It's fine. I mean, I guess we could board on uh, auto scouts now, I guess. Hurricane Slash. Instantly deal 30 damage to all nearby crew, including friendlies. Wow. Halved cooldown. How long is this cooldown? <laughs> yeah, that's a funny, sunny, funny sound. So if they have doors, I can't really use his ability. Unless I'm okay with doing how much was it 30 damage to my own crew does kazak get bonus damage passive is 120 on regular mantis 150 on kazak okay so do i want to stun or do i want to just have double mantis i feel like i'd rather just have double mantis and now we have a silly device please run be blessed Please bless my run. Although maybe I start. Maybe I send Kazak over as cleanup. Because this guy can stun it first. And then Kazak can come over and clean him up. 
I can use it to metal, medical airlock my own lanius. Now that's interesting. It would take forever if he's at full health, but... Okay. Yeah, only 120 on regular Mantis, so... Regular Mantis fighting has been nerfed on this... On, on, on uh... As a big gay. Apparently. Just learned. Oh, can I get shields? Okay, I didn't make shields more expensive. That's good. I'm still really susceptible to missiles, but at least I deal better against high shot lasers. Um, greetings, meatbags. You have entered Sacred Mantis Sparring Grounds. Have your crew fight our champion. You'll be rewarded. Refuse, you will die. Interesting. Does my Mantis just win? Two blue options here, huh? I don't want to fight this guy with this big giant missile. Let's do a uh, center mantis over. Crewmen must be without pride being your servant, but even for one of us, they fight well. Okay. Free stuff. Take it. Mantis might have 50% chance to win on that, you think? All right, NG wreck with life signs. Sole survivor of the mantis boarding party. No state to fight brought aboard. Uh, interrogate him with a mantis? I think that probably freaks him out. Let's do mind control interrogate. Boarding party was attempting to steal a weapon the NG ship was transporting. Team was wiped out. Ah, nice. Free Pierce Laser Mark III. Three power, four shots. At four damage, one shield piercing. Kind of don't love the shield, the, the heavy pierces. Don't love them. I would love to find a store over here just to repair, because I feel like this run is finally turning around, but I, I feel like a single missile ship is going to kill me. Kazak got me the Crimson Fury. Guaranteed to cause fires that burns with the Fury of the Mantis. Two power, 19 second charge time, three system damage, 45 personnel damage, and guaranteed fire. Why would I want to firebomb with Mantis Borders? But okay. I'm going to have this on the bar just for, you know, show them how to intimidate settlers, but... It's missing a tagline that's supposed to be exotic. Uh, what is that? Supposed to be a tag down here somewhere? Any other crew has a 20% chance to win, and without level 2 medbay, you lose them if they get defeated. Really? Does Clone Bay not protect in that event, RPG Nerdos? Or are you talking about a, an event in a different... in, in Captain's Edition? You're talking about events similar in Captain's Edition, gotcha. Okay, a lot of shots. We should be able to beat this guy. Especially when I can vent him. Okay, that pulls the pilot. Let's use your ability here. Go over and stun with our other guy. Then by time for Kazak to come over and finish him off. That's a quadruple fire, okay. Alright, silly device, you ready to be the boarding party connoisseur? Oh wait, we don't need you. <laughs> we finished him off. Alright, we got a free human. Alright, I needed more useless humans in my life. Wait, no, I didn't. It's a max repair human, though. Let's put him in shields, I guess. Now, this is a weird track. It's just wind. Um... I'm gonna save my scrap. I really want cloaking. You wanna be the guy on shield? Sure. 
I am Kazakh Thwar Kaiser. Challenge the Mantis Warship. Bomb and a bunch of heavy lasers. Okay. No teleporter on this guy. I should have refreshed my guys. Stun them. Start. Stun wears off. We mind control. Oh my god, if he hits my clone bay. Don't hit my clone bay. Thank god. Okay. Maybe with NG repair ability, that wouldn't actually kill us, but definitely don't want to test it. Okay. This track is crazy. Oh man, his his his, his missiles all is still up. Oh, this is terrifying. This is terrifying right now. Okay, let's use your ability. Oh, thank God he didn't hit. He didn't hit my clone bay, but the missile is still online. Come on, game. Or the bomb, I should say. Alright. You are Kazakh Thwar Kulikulik. I am Kazakh Kulikulik. And I shall destroy you. Alright, we're gonna try this new ability here. Best person to use it on? A human. Hurricane! Wooshua! <laughs> alright. A little less impressive than I thought it was gonna be, but alright, great. I am Kazakh. Storage Key Sigma. Ooh! I don't think I've unlocked the special Mantis ships, so. Okay. What do I replace here? This is more H Dog music, nice. Uh, let's lose. Oh man, these are all pretty useful. God, I sure wish you were a cargo I could put right here. I sure wish the keys were weapon things rather than. or drone parts. I wish the keys were drone parts so I did, they didn't get. I hate augment clutter in these mods. It drives me crazy. Um, I guess I'll lose the has suits even though they seem quite useful. All right, uh, let's see here. So I have basically enough for cloaking if I could just find a store with cloaking. Speaking of H Dog, Sleeper finally released his next project on Steam, Red Tether. Is this, is this a game you're talking about or uh, album? I'm not quite sure. Okay, we want them to basically kill each other right now. Double frickin' missile weapons, by the way. No weapons, by the way, get wrecked. Good. Oh, it's this event. If I let the if I board and they run with my crew on their ship, um we lose that crew, so I either wait for them to repair for this event, or I just kill them. Uh, we'll let them or let them run for the free weapon, I guess. After them, okay. Damn it! There's a store. I don't want to dive for the store. Although if I get cloaking, I could dive for the store. Alright, how likely is it to get cloaking here? Um, 
In this mod, you've added an extra page for stores, which I love, which makes it higher chance to find the stuff you want. But is it guaranteed? I have one system slot open. The things that could fill it are artillery, cloaking, drone control, hacking. So I don't think it's guaranteed. I don't think I'd take it, even though I'd like to heal and stuff too. Investigate. All right, we get to get rid of the human. Oh, and you wanted to be the shield guy, didn't you, RPG? Um, who's the most useless human? Fighting, fighting, engines. You have engines. I think Bryce. Although for fighting, the NGs are slightly better. Let's get rid of Bryce. Alright, this shall be you. You shall be Dash, what a name. You're not a Dash, you're an RPG nerd. O's. Alright, engine control sector is great. High chance to find a store and get cloaking. Well, there's the immediate quest, which then forces us through a uh, solar or whatever. Do that, and then we're gonna work on. We're gonna make sure we're always staying high enough to get cloaking. Then I want to get another weapon online. So many bomb, so many mantis bombers. Actually, I'm gonna use my hurricane on you guys. I'm gonna go here and let you guys fight it out while I use your ability. What I will say is, I'm digging the flexibility I'm getting of all these different abilities, though. Getting a better feel for what abilities I can, the different abilities do, and how I can use them. It's making for some interesting things that we can do, which I'm liking. Bomb offline. Um, I need to get his heal bay offline before I board. I guess we'd be using this power bomb, but if it dodges, it gets it's it's just worthless. If it gets dodged, I should I should say. Of course they're running. Every friggin' enemy runs in this galaxy. Jesus. <sighs> I can't stop him, can I? God damn it, man. I hate that. I hate that damn mechanic. Can any modder just take out the ability for enemies to run? Like, just, just take it out. Probably actually be a terrible thing, but my god, it drives me crazy when enemies run, like, every other goddamn fight. There. Eat that. And then let's use both your abilities here. Make sure I don't accidentally kill him from his from the solar flare. Okay, that's fine. Board here. Uh, I don't have special abilities, so we might not win this fight actually. I should use level two teleporter. Damn it! I've used their ability already. Okay, thank god we dodged that. Okay. Damn it if you if you knock out my clone bait. Okay, now we can't. Beautiful. 
Zoc will finish him. This is Mike, so wears out. Okay. There, help with this. There we go. For most normal encounters, you could remove their running away. Wouldn't do that for places like Mantis Ship running away in five seconds or Rock Quest, though, since it's necessary. Yeah, I think I'm just, I'm just get, I'm just, you know, angry t whining, but it probably it prevents soft locking, allowing running away in every situation. Goddamn missiles, man. Frickin' goddamn missiles. Missiles and bombs in every frickin' fight, man. Only the missile stays online. I'm so surprised. Two damage, double fire. Cool. Balanced weapon, that is. Wonderful. Okay, this is offline now, but now his laser's up. Okay, come be offline. Help to teleporter, kill the guys. Uh, I need Mantis to fight Mantis, I think. All right, get wrecked. Oh boy. I knew it was gonna be a stressful run. Every SMPK run is so stressful. I think I've only had one run where I felt like really strong. All right, store, please have cloaking. Please, every enemy has fricking missiles. God damn it. I, even, I didn't even count temporal drives, so yeah, I'm never gonna find cloaking, man. Every store is gonna have all this other crap. Not really crap, but you know, not what I want. Could just get hacking. Do I just get hacking and I can hack their missiles and stuff? Oh, what's gonna help me better against the boss fight? Boss has, I think, some extra weapons plus his artilleries in in SMPK. I think. Uh, hacking might be the way it allows you to separate the enemy inside the room from others, allows my crew to try and install the system. It's true. Hacking is really good boarding support. That's true. Yeah, I'm not worried about drone part usage. That's for sure. Just trying to decide. I, again, the SMPK boss fight is so different. Let's go hacking. Let's just do it. More expensive, but still overpowered in this mod. Um, with that, I could hack shield. So now, maybe I can sell the whole laser two and get power bomb. Having a guaranteed fire on some system rooms could be quite nice. But now we can't get cloaking, so let's go ahead and do. Let's do the level two shield or level two hacking for now. First, sector is this sector for six. Couple fuel there. This will be my. Uh... Wow, that was the same background. Elite ion blast. Wow. Okay. Um, chance to stun has a fire chance slightly faster interesting hacking also might actually buy time for second boarding party to be sent for four person boarding yeah yeah for sure except the free stuff Hacking, it's, it's the most versatile, best system in the game. 
jumpstart their shields with my generator. Nice. Cool. That's a cool blue option. Couldn't do this so I can use Ion Blast there. Level 2 Teleporter. I should just always buy hacking. ABH. When you play FTL, ABH. Always be hacking. Always buy hacking. That's just feel okay. <laughs> key to success at FTL, like the key to success, success on streaming. ABS always be streaming. ABH always be hacking. Uh, this guy can do damage to us, but he's got to get really lucky, so. Start with this. Bam. Silly device, go over and help kill some dudes with Kazak. <laughs> Do this. Send silly device out. So this guy goes. What a cha cha cha! Oh, why did you go over there? No, anyway, it's fine. It's fine. This and this. Okay. Too fast, bro. No, no. You there? You there? Oh god, just do it. Just do it twice, I guess. He can't touch me. I feel like I saw this ion self stack at one point. Asteroid field, I'll do that. Always be hacking, namaste. <laughs> okay. Uh Okay, that's a missile. So we will be hacking your missiles because you are not allowed to have them because that's cheating. We're actually going to do something interesting. I'm going to board, then I'm going to mind control to force him out of this room. Then I'm going to move to this room. And we're going to shoot the weapons after we've hacked the weapons. Going all in on all weapons offline. You do not get to have them. There we go. Okay. I believe. Get it here. Hacking will stop them. That's right. You go here. You go. What a cha cha cha! Hurricane! <laughs> that might be my favorite ability. Kazak Hurricane. Uh. If only there weren't 8,000 augments and only three slots. If only. My dream of FTL. Not being over... Over maxed on uh, augments in every multiverse or SMPK run I have. It's a dream of mine. <laughs> Only the OC burst stunner is capable of self chaining. OC. I'm not sure what OC means. There needs to be a separate thing for miscellaneous items. I agree. Or at least just make all the miscellaneous junk drone parts so they can go in the cargo bay. That would be my big solution for it. Just make them drone parts. Keys. Uh, whatever, whatever other random junk you want to add to it, just make them drone parts. Should never actually try to run, especially if I board him two more dudes. Should be good, right? There we go. Scooby-Doo. 
Oh, man. I mean, if this is literally supposed to be trade goods, they should go in the cargo, not in the augments. That's, that's where they should be. Let's just... I think that's the fix for every augment that's not actually doing anything. Change... It's not augmenting your ship. It should just be a cargo item, which means make it a drone part. Let's make it a drone part. Theoretically, it could be done with the invisible augment thing, but you're not actually not sure of exactly how they work or if it's even possible to make the game get rid of invisibles. Uh, yeah. Oh, you're talking about the hidden augment? I'm talking about that? Well, that's the worst two choices in the game. Abandon and Zoltan, Sector 6. I would rather have... I mean, Sector 7. I would rather have Slug, I think, than either of these choices, but I guess we're going Zoltan. Okay, half power. How much power do I have? 5, 10, 15, 18. Let's go 19. You experimented with making cargo augments, but you never put it in the hyperspace releases. You're, you're talking about you actually made augments that worked in the cargo hold? That's interesting. Okay, let's, uh, how do we want to do this? I'm gonna hack and board weapons is what we're gonna do here. Not working cargo, but you could put them in your cargo. Oh, man, I like that idea. Just on its own a lot. I do not have enough power here. But what I will do is this. Depower that, do that. Might control you. Hack the weapons. <laughs> Get blasted, crew. How's it feel? Get wrecked. Uh, you dodged that stun somehow. Get frickin' blasted, FTL. Eat that. Eat that. Bow to my superior tactics. M -m -m multi kill <laughs> That's right. Being able to move augments to cargo is pretty OP. Yeah, I think... Honestly, I kind of think that's the thing that should be in FTL. But... They're different shapes, so you gotta change the programming or something. I'm sure there's some, you know, very basic programming reason why that's not very easy to do. You think for stuff that only goes in the cargo, you might consider making weapons drones that have a flag that prevents them from actually being equipped? Yeah, that, that sounds... That's, I think, how I wish... Things like... Storage Key Epsilon, or... Multiverses quest item needed for Vulcan thing. That's how I think they should be handled. Non-equipable weapons. I think that's what they should be. I think that should just be how they are existing. Yep, the slow hack drone. Rand, I hate you, FTL. Now drown in a shallow bathtub. That's right. That's right. Die in a fire! Or in the bathtub when you drop the... Ouch, it's got... That's a piercing goddamn halberd. Or, uh... You know, drop a toaster in your bath water, FTL. Oh, because <laughs> Sok is actually too good at repairing and repaired that before we get there. Die in the airlock that is more convenient than a fire. There you go. That'll work too. Six. Do I want to go to the store still? I mean, I don't have any augments spaces to put things. Oh, running away with a missile and cloaking. Actually, a missile and a bomb. How about triple... You, FTL. At least 
we got a dodge. Thank God that iron thing didn't hit my weapons. And I have to hit his piloting. So now he still gets to cloak and bomb me from safety. Okay, at least he didn't hit my weapons. This fight right here is why I tell FTL to go F itself and die in a fire and all the other mean things I say to it. This is stupid. This is a dumb event. It's this combo with shit shouldn't exist. Get, get the, your combo of shiznit out of here. If I actually had to live in FTL Galaxy, which of the vanilla cruisers would I pick? What's what's a cruiser in vanilla? Are you talking about just which of uh, the ships? Just FTL player ships? Uh... Mantis B, because it starts with two shields and defense drones, so theoretically it should be the safest? I don't know. Alright, stiff dough is nice. Not NGB, yes. Anything but NGB. It's forever alone. Also not Lanius B, because I don't want to get vented. Let's get all of our subsystems in O2. And then let's get one more dodge, since missiles are what's killing us every time. Another power. Okay. Not stealth B, because you will insta-die. Right, four shields. Triple drones, okay. He can do damage to us with Halberd Beam piercing a shield. All right, uh, we're gonna hack. We gotta hack shields, actually. This lets us move around the ship easier, too. So. Do this. Mind control this. Use your special ability. Hack it. I'm not use my arm because I don't want to stun my own dudes. I'll shoot your drone control. Okay. Stun enemies. Then. If you guys board over here. Wow, they opened every hacked door there. Okay. Let's go in here. Oh, some really good dodges, damn it. Let's do this. Now that the doors are closed again. Uh there, let's use that special ability. Tough fight with double board or double repair drones and an extra anti personnel drone. Jesus. Okay, finish these guys off. Any more abilities I can use? for Zold and Shield. There's a good one. That's a good choice. Alright, I can check both doors. Do I even want to check both doors? Well, I do want to heal, so... 
Arn Zoltan's not welcoming to Filthy Humans. You'd go for a Fede because it's a big ship and probably has decent crew quarters. Okay, here you go. <laughs> you like to have room for activities. Um, I'm probably going to keep the bomb, try to get it online. Just go repair. One, two, three. This is Sector 7. That was a four cost repair in Sector 7. Is that. That's a buff from vanilla. Room for activities, aka the venting room. That's right. I'll get max clone bay so I heal more per jump. I don't think I need to go to this other store, right? So I want to find other weapons, but I feel like these weapons will do. That'll do, pig weapons. That'll do, pig weapons. Free stuff, okay. We're gonna get this power bomb online. Although, I wonder if I'd rather have. <sighs> we'll probably do need four shield with no cloaking. Always sketchy to not have four shields. You don't have cloaking and. Uh... Well, in any FTL, any version of FTL, but especially. I didn't put my crew back in place. I need to. Save your position there. Especially in the mods where you're not as powerful. That is nice. I think I accidentally hit the slug stun while in a room where there's no enemies, so it's pretty nice that it didn't allow me to do that. Good dodges. Good frickin' doges, man. No heals. Beautiful. Go here. I can actually fight him in here. Oh, I stunned my own dude. So it was a debate. I wanted them to come in this room so I could attack them while they're trying to get in there. Chain burst laser. Would I want that over the power bomb? Wow, you buffed the chain burst laser, right? Initial charge time is 16 in vanilla. I think that's buffed. Well, I'd rather have it than ion blast right now if I can. Uh, so reason you cannot get hyperspace custom stores to emulate the repair prices of vanilla. Huh. It won't stop snowing where you are, great mate. Where are you? Probably somewhere up north or over in Europe. I don't know, but definitely not in Texas if it's Texas if it won't stop snowing. Actually, let's go. Yeah. Stun that guy. We go in here. Use that ability. Then do this. Uh, Cornland, aka Ohio. Nice. That does sound like a place where it would start snowing and not stop. Uh, mid, mid, the Midwest. Is that what that would be called? The Midwest. It goes from 16 to 13 to 10 to 7 to 13. Oh, compared to 13 to 11 to 9 to 7. Yeah, so that is definitely a buff, I think. I believe that's a buff. I mean, first charge being faster is just easy, easily a buff. Oh god, okay, you're boarding with three Mantis. If I have you get mind controlled, you should go fight those two guys, right? Nice. We run and we hurricane all of them, even the mind controlled guy, which is pretty awesome. 
You guys go in here and use your stun ability. Come on. Come on. Use your ability. Wow, that was really insane dodges. Okay. Let's just attack the heal bay. Make this quicker, I think. Okay, could you not dodge everything, please? Okay. We didn't dodge everything. We did dodge some stuff, though. Okay. Keep boarding with silly device. <laughs> silly device, best border. Fight me, IRL. Best border. IRL. Oh, okay. Shield trained. Uh, we got rid of get, get it. Got to get rid of a human. I think I can put RPG Nerdos on engines and Vivamord replace Hans here. Okay. So you have level one engines. You'll eventually get up to level two and we put you on shields. Sorry, RPG Nerdos, you've been demoted to engines, but I'm sure you'll do a great job. Okay, 55 scrap. <sighs> I should probably save scrap for force shield and third hacking upgrade. I can't remember if you gave the boss five shields. I know multiverse does in phase one, but I can't remember if you did that for, for your mod. You didn't give it five shields? Okay. Just 8,000 weapon power. <laughs> you know, just that. Five crew. You know what? I'm just gonna blow up this ship. Oh god, don't blow up my hacking drone though. Good dodge. Oh my. The hell is this piece of shit that insta gibbed my shit? God damn it, game. All these OP frickin' weapons that everybody has. It's insane. Is that a pierce thing, or did he just have the fastest beam travel I've ever seen? Get blasted. Cloaking in a missile, lovely, wonderful, balanced, amazing. God damn it, I just hacked his doors. Please get that goddamn missile offline. Thank you. Okay. Yes, I totally wanted to hack doors. That was the most important system to get offline. Lol. Hey, it locked him in here with us, I guess, though. Good. Nope. Oh, that's level 3 heal bait. Of course it is. No surrender. I kill you. I kill you. Okay. Yeah. 
And we'll have nine drone parts. Let's do it. That should help us get to uh, fourth shield. Just cruiser type C. Okay. Oh, please. This is... Okay, I need to get... I wish the key turn-in was here. I really don't like that you have to get to the base. I really wish the key turn-in was here. But, uh, let's see. Toolkit. Two power. 25 seconds. It gets up to one shot every two seconds. So it's like a half of a Vulcan. Or half the power. Yeah, I don't think I want any of that. So I have to get to the base before the boss. Yeah, that should be no problem. Let's get our force shield here. I want to guarantee we get the unlock. Okay. Wow, that is a very fast shot. Okay, well, F that. Screw trying to get that through, that's not ever happening. Oh, with this anti-drone drone. Well, okay, well, we just blasted it. He's running, eh? <sighs> He's also dodging 8,000% of my shots. I better do this. I do not want to lose. Uh, you know what? Let's just do this. This will guarantee it. Okay. Screw your running away. Get wrecked. No running away. Only 37 scrap in Sector 8, eh? Eh? I'd like to get this last weapon power. I doubt it's gonna happen. Doo -doo. What are you hacking? Hacking my weapons? I don't know if I'm ever going to kill this guy, honestly. He's got four shields, hacked my weapons, and a big giant missile. I might just run away from this both shiznizzle snizzle of a fight. Unless I got the missile offline right now. If we don't dodge this, we're running. That's a hit. F your missiles. Oh man, if I get the repair, it's worth to take it. God, is it actually worth it? I don't know if it is. Frickin' level 3 hacking, man. And of course it's only a f***ing missile that's online. Only that one. Got it. Got it. I do get 5 repair reviving, arriving at the base. Okay. This fight's gonna last a year long. This missile hit ran jumping away instantly the moment it phases through shields. Is it? Yes, yes, it, it would have been if I had let it. Sorry, it did it did hit. Oh my god. God damn it, I hate this. I hate this so much. This is so boring, FDL. You're so boring with your fing FDL boring stuff with boringness and hacking my weapons and boring so bored right now take a freaking year to do anything thank god all right this is only level two hacking really okay it's breach too which is god that's a relief okay all right 
You bore me, FTL. You're boring. I'm bored. I'm bored, okay? I'm so bored right now. Okay, now I'm not bored. You're dead. Killing you has entertained me. Are you not entertained? 90 for level 3 hacking. Jesus. Normally it's what? 80 into 60 at the max? It's 190. Wow. It's expensive. No enemy gets level 3 hacks. Are you sure? Doesn't the boss get that? Maybe not. Dodges. Uh, hey, what's up, Danger McLovin? Thanks for 200 bits. Long time worker. Glad to see you're still rocking some FTL. Such a good game. Cheers. Such a good game, except when I'm raging at it, saying how shitty of a game it is. <laughs> Which I've done a lot today. Can I, can I dodge one of these ions? You, you buffed this weapon, didn't you? I think you did. Last mark two. I, if I remember correctly. All right, let's get the repair, then we get the base just in time. Base one's hacking got nerfed from level three to level one. Thank God, level three hacking was stupid. <sighs> Is the extra ion better than the level three hacking? I kinda need power too. Well it wouldn't be weapon buffer, it'd be good to get the ion blast online, so I, I think I I think I do like that better. This kind of serves as the third level of hacking anyway, because this as long as it hits gets a shield down. Uh, I think the boss does have level two hacking in vanilla. Federation Elite Inventory. Inventory. The hell's that? Unique multi-purpose augment. A collection of next generation crew equipment. It's free, uh, retrieved from the Federation base, granting all friendly crew members a 20% increase in all critical stats. Wow, does that stack with Ability Enhancer? Because that's pretty awesome. Hey, thanks for 200 bits, Plunderbig. Although I don't know why it didn't come through... Wait, I see 200 bits, but I don't see them. Oh, no, no. Weird. Oh, you were just saying PogChamp for the bits. Gotcha. I don't know what the difference between a critical stat and a non-critical stat is, so don't exactly know what that means. Okay, O2 hack is fine. Now, where do I want to board? Shields, I think. Control where we go. Although I don't want to use the Ion Blast with my dudes are inside, though. Okay, we don't have cloaking here. <laughs> Fuck this game, man. Fuck this game. Single missile, double fire in my hacked O2. This would be fine. This would be fine. Except that this game is fucking bullshit, man. Alright, I, got, I gotta get rid of this hacking or else my entire crew is gonna die. So, I have to do this. Just goddamn you, FTO.
Let's use my quick repairing ability here. And wait till the fire's out. Another double fire, at least. Now you're locked in there, which sucks. Use his ability there. Okay. Columbia offline, so all these crew kills stay killed. Good. Okay, it's another good kill. We have to wait for this cloaking here. F your missiles. I mean, I guess, great. Thank you for not missiling my weapons, I guess. All right, I don't want to kill any more crew. I do want to stop these goddamn missiles, though. Okay, that's good. Okay, that's another crew kill. It's great. Three crew left. Did you do a thing where they respawn crew? I, I can't remember. I sure hope not. Between phases, why can I not dodge anything with 45% dodge? Okay, I should finish him. One crew kill. Do this. I got a lot of crew kills, but that was a shit ton of damage because of stupidness. 18 scrap, eh? Uh, they get one crew per phase. Okay, it's not terrible. No pause in SPK insurrection win. I think I did that way back in the day. I think I did a hard mode no pause for every ship back, way back when, when SMPK was not in hyperspace years ago. But probably not anytime soon. So, don't hold your breath. Okay. I would love to get some extra repair right now. We took so much damage there. The killing crew should make these phases easier. I didn't get... Uh, did I get... No, that was the last one where I got advanced FTL navigation. That would be really helpful right now to be able to jump back there. They nerf good boy and friendly spirit hard. Hey, what's up, Firehawk? That is actually really good to hear, because those were so broken. I got to... I'm at 3,800 MMR some or so, so I'm hoping... I'm probably not going to play Storybook Brawl on stream, unless I just want to fill some time at some point soon, but... I'm getting close to that 4K, and I might see if I can do that thing. Apply on the whatever it's called on there. That is not what I meant to freaking hack, okay. On their uh, Discord or whatever. Okay, killed that guy quickly, that's good. Nice! Beautiful. They buffed Dwarves and Jormungandr. Ooh, I like Jormungandr. It's never been good, but I like him. Maybe he'll be good. Maybe Slay Build will not be ridiculously horrible now. Okay, he's got a Combat 2 drone online. Can I get that offline? Okay, good. Kills. I think I'm gonna kill him before I get crew kills. Oh, 
actually... Uh, I think they're considered alive if clone bays up, right? I don't know how your SMPK boss works if I kill crew, but... Clone bay is still alive? Does that consider them still alive? When they jump? Who the hell knows how that mechanic works? You're floating around the same, we'll make it. Dwarves are always buff. Well, now they're buffer. Normal Gutter gets plus 20, plus 20 every time any of your characters slay. And when he slays. Wow, that's amazing. That makes me want to do a Yorman Gunder slay build, actually. Guess we'll find out. Well, one crew spawns, so there's a guy on the side. A guy who might have been in the side room. Um, bugged out. We killed those two guys. Who the hell knows how many crew's going to be here? I don't know. 55 scrap. What do I want? Value point here. I guess that's all. And swag sensors. Swag sensors, they're cheaper. So it means they're better, right? It's got two crew. Okay, it looks like Clone Bay did kill. That's really nice. Alright, your crazy drone final phase. Alright. But no more boarding to deal with at least, so that's great. Okay, super duper speed repair. Stop that. Repair through. Oh my god, we're fighting the boss in a solar flare too. Why? Because, you know, this game's not hard enough, that's, uh, that's what I guess. I just even, I just realized that. I'm so focused on this, I didn't even realize that. Oh, by the way, I'm in a solar flare right now. Okay, no. Nope. None of those guys is good. I am actually going to do this. This is anti-personnel drones are offline. That's great that he might control my guy, not theirs. Beautiful. Alright, we... have nine health. Hopefully we got this. Oh, good. Some damn dodges. Beautiful. Some clutch dodges. Alright, I can auto-fire. 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 Oh, Jesus. My shields were down because of stupid power BS. Okay. Your special repair is not up. Yours is, though. Okay, I think we got him. GG! GG! Oh my god! Frickin' solar flare of a fight! Why? Because you're apparently supposed to get inefficient engines to guarantee you don't, go, don't get that. The turncoat ship. The rebel version of whatever. Oh my god, my crew never returned. I know, they, they got they got cloned though, it's fine, it's fine. Oh my god. So I think we unlocked... Nice, we unlocked a... No, wait, did we already had the Mantis one on? Damn it, I thought we were unlocking a new one. I keep unlocking the same three ships over and over. I guess it's because I'm going to NG sectors and Mantis sectors a lot. Do I need to go to Zoltan sectors to unlock the Zoltan and... Civilian for the Federation, slug for the uh, slug. I mean, I don't know. Mantis R. Oh, oh, I did. Okay, so I it's the random ships that I'm locking with the keys. Okay, so I did unlock this one. I guess. How the hell do I unlock these guys then? Rescue a Federation cruiser in distress. Help the Zoltan border police apprehend some pirates. Oh God. A nebula where the NG have been working on advancements. Arranged marriage between rock royalty. Black Raven forces captain into humiliating, humiliating, humiliating surrender. Type A of every other ship. Take part in the Federation's retrieval operation. Alright, so it's quests I gotta find and do correctly, which 
Honestly, that might be pretty tough because I have my set things that I do and it might be different choices I have to make. I'll have to try to remember all that. Rock A and Slug A plus. Rock A plus and Slug A plus are from vanilla events. Yeah. I recognize this is the uh, Ariadne Grande quest or whatever. Slug A, Black Raven. Is that the... Captain Knights, because I'm pretty sure we ran into Captain Knights this run. I wonder if I was supposed to do something else or something. Well, my friends, I don't know, but uh, SMPK is always pretty stressful and challenging, so I think I'm going to call it a day there. So thank you all for watching. hope you enjoyed. Thank you to Slow Rider and uh, RPG Nerdos for the created ships. And if anybody does want to create ships, remember you can always send them to me uh, by whispering on Twitch. Uh, tomorrow we're going to play some Auction Not Included, and Wednesday we'll play Harbo No Pause. Consider, continue with our, uh, uh, random ship streak, so. Yeah, I think I updated my schedule correctly. I don't know if I got all of them updated, but I think I did. So it should be FTL and Oni this week. If I get to the point where I just have no more FTL ships to play, maybe I'll give that, um, ins inscription game a try, or... Or maybe play some... As, uh, some storybook brawl or something, but my brain is fried from that run, so I'm gonna call it a day. So thank you all again for all the support, for hanging out, following, bidding, subbing, just being cool and being you and hanging out with me. You all make this a blast. Uh, again, if there's anybody new, hit the follow. We'll play. We'll play more games this week. So until next time, my friends. I hope you all have a great night. Peace out, happy gaming. I will see you all tomorrow for some Oni. Y'all rock. Have a great night, my friends.